Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Levy and I'm going to do a tarot reading for the Sagittarius uh, folks for uh, uh, for next week. But it doesn't really matter which week you're actually looking, uh, watching this video because it's a timeless video. If you watch it today, then it's for the next seven days. If you enjoy the video, hit the like button. I'm just growing this channel now, so quite new. Um, and every little help helps. Uh, so let's get to it. Okay, so if you're going through some uh, disturbing news or heartbreak or heartache, um, anything like anything like that, something dis a disappointment is. Well, look, we can be when it comes to disappointment, when it comes to like negative experiences with other people, it's circumstances. Uh, that can really bring us down and as much as as intellectually we can um, we can we can rationalize them and we can say yeah well but it wasn't that good anyway still the pain is still there okay so um, <clears throat> you must move on but that can only happen if you let yourself move on so don't try to rationalize everything because that just being is like taking a uh, taking a pill. I'm just going to numb the pain and that means the pain no longer exists. No, no, the, the pain is actually exists is more than you think because it goes down to your subconscious and it comes back when you don't really want it or you don't even realize when it comes back, but it comes back to it, comes back to you. So, um, emotionally you have to channel it down okay so just because it's in your head is not going to move away it needs time in its energy in its caring in its love um, you're not doing too bad you're not doing too bad Opportunities are all around you, but the question is, how, where, where are you going to put your focus on? Are you going to focus on things you have lost? Are you going to focus on things that you don't have control over it? Or are you going to get uh, focus on things that you can actually make happen? So, so you have here, you have here the the um, King of Wands. Which this guy here is is uh, some people call it a real entrepreneur. Like this is this is the mentality. This is the stability. What you want to feed a fiery person, you know, he's got like comes and like like wipes the whole room off uh, with the ideas and thoughts and, and the possibilities. And it doesn't feel um, it doesn't feel controlled or limited. This is somebody who is limitless. So now you have you have two cards in here. You have the intellectual plateau. You have the 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 um, king of swords, and below that the king of wands. So you in your mind you are pretty pretty damn intelligent. You are you know how sharp you are, and you have the work ethic as well, right? You have the work ethic. You know how to make something happen. It's like this one thing that, oh yeah, I can think of something smart. Yes, you can think of something smart, but you can do something smart as well because you have the qualities of the of this um, uh, king of wands. And then comes down to the justice in here. So if you do the work, you worked out yourself, you worked out how to make that happen, so you have the activities done, 
and then you move on to the next phase where all the good stuff coming in for you. This is communication, this is change, this is uh, movement, this is, you know, what you worked, you worked for this and now this is here. Not to mention that the ace of wands in here. So what else you want? Like you, you have to move out from, from that, oh yeah, but I lost something. Yeah, we all lost something, that's not a big deal. Yeah, but somebody have stolen something from me, uh, which doesn't belong to them. Okay, so what? Are you going to spend your life uh, contemplating on what people um, stolen or taken from you, an idea or, or an item or something? Or you want to make 10 times more? Because, because this is what it is about. It's like, it's, it's, we can, we can, uh, yes, but uh, what if, no, justice is served. Justice will give everybody that they deserve and justice is blind justice is there it put you on a scale you belong here you belong there you got to get here because that's what you deserve you get that so you should not worry about what other people is doing saying taking stealing uh, whatever you worry about you you worry about the opportunities you make the opportunities happen and in the meantime you give yourself time to heal as well Okay, emotionally, you have to give yourself time because things are moving to the right way, moving to the right direction because you have been putting into the work, you can, you have been putting the work into it. So I bet you wanna, you wanna uh, enjoy the reward, right? So you can only enjoy the reward if you're physically fit. You wanna be physically fit, healthy. Uh, emotionally open to to opportunities ideas new people new places new new things coming in if you are not if you are not available you hold yourself hold yourself in a prison in your own mind and together with this well look you want to stay in your head as much as you like but i don't think so that will be beneficial to anybody please focus on what you can actually craft you know it's like oh yeah but I have this appointment in my hand yes but your hands can still craft some nice uh, uh, sculpture or paint or picture or so channel it down so if you have a pain fine channel it down channel it down something more creative something more useful something more uh, yeah you have a story to tell fine write it down paint it draw it um, play it as an actor or actress doesn't matter but channel it down let it calm down and so so the pain is not not up there and it's not going to go down to the subconscious and hit you when you when you last um, uh, you least expect it right uh, you have to do the work you have to do the work and you're going to be in the dark but again it's your choice and follow your intuition follow your intuition to make the right decision okay because you have you have the intellect you are pretty clever so using your head but not only your head will be most beneficial okay certain things might not turn out the way you expected you might lose something and and you know you invested in and oh my god something doesn't something doesn't produce um whatever as i said with the other cards in here that maybe somebody tricked you or cheated on you or whatever you least expected and things didn't turn out the way you wanted them well tough that's life we don't get everything we want in life but if you trust that the justice will always be served and the universe know exactly what you want and again the judgment is here um well this this is this is this is a similar similar stuff in here it tells you that you shouldn't worry about what is gone it's done it's nothing it no longer exists if it's not yours it's not yours it's gone forget it move on get something else get something new get something more that's what the universe wants from you wake up wake up what you have this is what you have this is there's no uh, wealth no clothes no anything this is what you have look look at yourself this is what i have 
Is that enough? Yes, it is. Can I do something about it? Yes, you can, as much as you like. Move on, get something done, get uh, um, uh, more understanding and be positive, okay? This is resurrection. This is come out from your dead, from your grave. Get out, start moving. Why? Because you are not dead. It's as simple as that. You might felt you were, but it's no longer a case. This is after this, okay? So that's done. Go on, happy, move on. Come on, let's get something new, something new, something new. But if you hold yourself back, then you're not going to happen. Because you are tied to that, that wooden, wooden uh, uh, pole. You have to let yourself cut off, cut, cut yourself off from the pain, cut yourself off the negative uh, memories, for, from the uh, issues, problems, and be the dancer. Okay? And be happy, because it is possible, because your sin have been taken away, right? it doesn't matter which, like, you know, whoever has one religion, uh, it's still the same. So it's like you, you, can, you can move on to the next, next phase of your life. That's what's important. Because karma, justice, is always going to give you what you deserve. So come back uh, with peace. Make sure your inner child is looked after. Okay? It never, it don't, if that, there is any bruise or anything, just soothe it. Okay? Spend some time alone if necessary. Spend some time um, doing something you normally don't do anymore. You don't have time to do anymore. Eat well, sleep, just play, uh, have something have something joyful, something simple, something easy. Exactly. You see, stay like this. That was accident. I put it back in this way. So you see, this is the right way of looking at things. This is the right way, not this way. Okay? All right. So, dear Sagittarius, let me draw a couple of cards from the from my Secret Destiny Oracle card. Actually, we have release, what I was talking about, let it go, let it go, patience, I don't have to make it up, it's all here, and miracles, right, so release the old patterns, old memories, old fear, old issues, old problems, release them and let them go, patience will help you slow down you don't need to do anything uh, today and tomorrow you slow down and you see the reality when you're slower okay and then miracles trust the universe that everything is gonna be right everything is in the right order everything is gonna be fine it's not everything is your responsibility move on from the old patterns and get and let the universe to create the miracles for you, with you, within you, around you, um, and everywhere else. So thank you for watching, dear Sagittarius. I hope you enjoyed. Click the, the like button. I'll come back to you with more videos. And it was a pleasure doing that for you. I really enjoyed. And um, yeah, this is what I have for today. Thank you very much.